Hello guys, what's up? This is Andrew again. We are back with another video, and in this video, I'm going to give you ten easy ways to make money online, and these are one of the most popular ways as well. In order to make huge money and huge amount of money in 2022, so let's stay with the video till the end, and let's get started as well. So first is training and teaching. This is something uh, that a lot of people have been doing for more than uh, you can say thousands of years. Institutions, public institutions. government institutions institutions from across the globe have been doing this for more than centuries so how does it work you go ahead you find the subject you are good at and you create a video or maybe a set of videos on that you create a course on that and you try to sell it in front of the public to the public and right now in this modern age we have access to internet and every single person has access to it so if you are selling a course in the streets holding pamphlets of your course um i guess 10 or 20 people would be looking at what you are selling but if you are selling it online thousands of people would be looking at what you are selling so that is what it is uh, it is training and teaching so you can go ahead you can create a course on anything you want and you can put it in front of the public by using different channels and different software is available online it could be youtube it could be i would say an academy it could be any other platform you know and it could be any other platform i am actually letting you know that is patreon you can go ahead and sell your course on patreon this is a free website that allows you to put your course on in front of the public you can sell your pdfs you can sell your books you can sell your video courses or maybe you can sell your audio courses online in front of the people to the people and people will be making a purchase and by using this technique you can make around $1000 in a day and it is a leggy technique so this was the first technique let's move towards the second that is offering a service so what offering a services um offering a service is what freelancers are doing freelancing is you know that you have a skill you showcase it in front of the people and people go and make a purchase you sell it on a platform where there are a lot of buyers and a lot of sellers so buyers interact with sellers and get a you can say order done and when get they when they get an order done they get a few you can say dollars that could be 15 or 25 dollars but if you actually going to summarize that earning um at a monthly perspective it would be around 300 to 400 dollars on any month okay so while you are actually working two or three hours a day but if you are working constantly and if you are working seriously or if it is a major source of earning for you you can earn more than 2 or 3 lakhs in indian rupees on any month by doing what you want to do and what you love to do okay so that is offering a service let's move towards the third thing that is creating and selling product so what is creating and selling product is so what happens is there are a lot of products in the market but when when you are able to get a product being prepared by your own entity or by in your own you can say somewhere separate production house then a product comes out and when that product you want you sell it to public that is what creating and selling product you can create any product you can create your own pdfs you can create your own courses you can create your own i would say um books you can write books on anything like you can write books on linkedin how to use linkedin significantly you can write books on how to use instagram to your advantage you can go ahead and write a course on how you can go ahead and uh, get uh, facebook to your advantage you can write course on anything you want to write you can write a course on how to make great youtube videos and you can sell it to public that is what creating and selling product is you can create your products by going in a factory by collaborating with a factory and it would be creating a solid product for you a materialistic thing for you and you can go ahead and put it in front of the public and if people are interested they will be making a purchase so that is the third thing let's move towards the fourth point that is membership sites and content programs so membership sites are basically sites that run on a membership basis where you put a con where you put content for another company or another entity on their behalf on their page and you get paid for that suppose if i am working as a freelancer and i maintain pages for people that simply means i run pages for people on their behalf i am promoting their content only but i am getting paid for that so that is what membership site is and continuity program is something like when people purchase your newsletter you must be knowing about newsletter about newsletter what newsletters are newsletters are basically personal analyze emails being sent on a weekly on daily and on monthly basis on quarterly basis as well 
so when people would be making a purchase for your product over and over, over again that is a continuity program that same thing applies when you are selling a course online suppose you are selling a course and you have sold the first volume but you want people to purchase further to make a purchase ahead as well and in your next course as well so that it's when the continuity program things come in its uh, existence okay so suppose if i have sold one of my courses online and i have further videos of that courses and you can say an advanced form of that course i am going to sell it again and if people are purchasing it that is what continuity program stands for let's move towards the fifth thing that is affiliate marketing so if you don't know about affiliate marketing you can go ahead and click on the video maybe the link coming up uh, somewhere around the screen so i have created a lot of videos on affiliate marketing affiliate marketing is something when you go ahead and you try to sell a product by its link and when people would be making a purchase you will be getting a high commission or maybe a really big money as a commission a really big part of that pie as a commission it could be 70% commission it could be 80% commission you can do affiliate marketing using clickbank using Amazon Associates or some other sites which are offering services and free links of the really well reputed products like you can say iPhone um boat products or you can say apple products or maybe you can say boss products if you don't know about that canon sony any app you know about or maybe any company you know about or know about they are somewhere promoting affiliate marketing they want people to promote their affiliate links over the internet and when people would be making a purchase using your link you would be getting a really high commission while working around for 2 or 3 hours in a day and while working only in order to get those sales done so that is the fifth technique and let's move towards the sixth technique sixth technique is building a site and selling ads so what does it mean when you build a website you get a lot of empty space on your website like you can see here on the left side of the screen there is a lot of empty space right and on the right side same is happening we have a lot of empty space so the same empty space and the same promotion of empty space you get when you are creating a web page online okay so when you have a web page online and you promote content suppose if i am writing content on the same thing that's when i am getting a lot of empty space on my page and when i am actually promoting other people's product or other entities product on my page that entity or that particular person or individual would be paying me money in order to get their services promoted on my web page and that is what it means building a website and selling ads and to, if i have to give you a you can say really great idea what you can do is you can create an affiliate marketing website and you can go ahead you can put um a few affiliate marketing links on your with your content with your paragraphs you are writing or with the original content you are writing and you can on the other hand put uh, ads of the same product by contacting the same or uh, you can say vendor and once anybody would be visiting your page they would be clicking on the ad they would be clicking on the links and they would be making a purchase you will be getting commission for affiliate marketing products as well apart from that you would be getting a really great you can say promotional package in order because you have somewhere promoted that service by uh, with uh, you can say um pro by promoting it its ad on your web page so that is the sixth technique let's move towards the seventh <clears throat> the seventh uh, is selling sponsorship and branded content so what does it mean selling sponsorship is something when you like you must have seen this thing over the internet that uh, a lot of youtubers want you to subscribe their paid membership that is by clicking the join button you become a member of their channel and a lot of uh, you can say different um it works on linkedin as well people want you to buy their services or maybe buy their podcast or maybe buy their podcast on spotify buy their podcast on you can say patreon or maybe at some other platform that is what it means when you sell something branded people gonna buy it and when they are buying it you are making money suppose if i have that join button on my youtube channel i am going to make it public and when people would be clicking on that particular join button and when people would be making a purchase i would be getting around 10 dollars for just 
one person and that person would be getting access to my branded content so suppose if i'm creating branded content and creating a 60 second video for my um 60 second short video in which i am elaborating everything about affiliate marketing they would be getting access to that so that's what it means that what that's what means um by bread and content and let's move towards the selling sponsorship what does it mean selling sponsorship is something when you go ahead and uh, you get a sponsor for your advertisement and when a company contacts you to promote their product on your uh YouTube channel and they want you to create a video for that or maybe they just want a small proportion of out of your video maybe of for 30 seconds for 40 seconds you go ahead and you promote their product it could be any product suppose if I am selling on uh, this particular suppose if I'm selling particular this thing I would be promoting it on in my YouTube video and this company later on be paying me and when this company is paying me for promoting their services that's when they become my sponsor okay let's move towards the eighth thing that is event you can create event about anything you can create events for your online courses being launched online you can create events for your online book or you can create events for your online pdf being launched online you can create events for your um Instagram post, you can create events for your YouTube videos and when you create events, people get connected to that and if you are promoting a service, you are going to get money from both the sides. So that is the eight step or maybe a technique. Let's move towards mastermind and coaching masterminds. Obviously, if you know, don't know about this mastermind, if I have to simplify this word, it would be, you know, running podcast channel on YouTube or maybe at some other platform, you can go ahead and you can create, start creating your own podcast about maybe about meditation you can create podcast about yoga you can create podcast about space uh, you can create a podcast about the marine life we have you can create podcast about anything anything you are interested in if you are good in sports say football you can create podcast about football if you are good in with the technology you can go ahead and create a podcast about technology how technology is working how innovation is going how globalization is helping innovation how innovation is helping globalization and a lot of things so far and so far so on and so forth okay so that's how it goes and coaching is something that is related to the first point we discussed the first point we discussed is teaching and training so what teaching and training is you create a uh, some sort of videos or a product of the particular skill you want to sell and when people would be buying that particular product or set of videos in order to learn the same technique you are selling that's when uh, coaching comes in its role so coaching is something when you are trying to sell something to people they would be interesting in uh, learning what you are selling or maybe they just want to learn it in order to sell it further okay so that's the coaching thing and let's move towards the 10 thing it's just getting creative it could be anything like suppose if you are a freelancer and you are selling your services online on fiverr you can do one more thing to escalate your services that is something you can go ahead and start your own page on instagram of the same services and you can start creating your portfolios you can feature one of the best products you have or maybe best projects you have on your instagram page or maybe on your linkedin page or maybe on your twitter page or maybe on your facebook page you can go ahead and use your creativity to escalate your particular service in more than different channels okay more different channels or more than one different channels or maybe you can start um, by you know mixing things with different things like if you are selling a course online you can mix it somewhere with affiliate marketing okay you can promote like suppose if i am selling a course on fitness if i teach uh, people how they can actually get fit uh, while working out at home okay i can go ahead and sell different uh, work of equipment being used at home um, and I just have to provide you know, with them with the link of that particular product. And if they are making a purchase, that's when I get paid. Okay, that's when I get um, a lot of commission for that affiliate marketing product. So, uh, plus, apart from that, they would be paying me, my subscribers or my purchasers would be paying me for buying my course as well. So suppose if I'm my, selling my course at around, you can say $300 and I have prepared 10 videos for that and I have put a few links in the description as well. So that's somewhere uh, you can say, um, help me 
to get more than one fifty dollars as an affiliate marketing commission. So that's how it goes. Getting creative thing. Okay, so uh, this was a list of ten basic techniques and ten most popular techniques over the internet to make money online. And that's it for today's video, guys. If you like the video, don't forget to like my video. If uh, you want me to more create more videos about this you can go ahead and comment your suggestions and if you haven't subscribed my channel please go ahead and subscribe it it somewhere gives me motivation to create more authentic content and thank you all for watching this video stay tuned for my further videos as well